My friends, welcome back. We're playing EU Forest Cologne. We're currently in a war with Munster, uh, which is actually going quite nice. Now, I'm thinking about splitting these troops up and making sure we get some more of uh, this guy's money. So, let's just get two regiments. So, we'll keep the others and just send those over there. We do need to reinforce our troops. Uh, but it wouldn't be too long. Nassau and Munster can no longer build any trips. It is quite over for them. Um, my participation has been quite well in this war. And it's actually... Uh, it, there were different times. Uh, which is highly unfortunate. And now we are rating 0.29. And we're making a good amount of money. Shortly, we can actually repay one more loan. We can already repay a loan. I'm actually going to. Why not? Why not? We can always just take it back. But uh, getting that additional money is quite nice. So, let this raid continue. We'll just wait until the sieges are done. And we'll deal with uh, Liege. Or Liege, or whatever. Uh, there's a food shortage over here. We don't care about it, of course. There we go. That fell. How much money is still there? Yeah, there's still a bunch. Not so much on this. Uh, once this is almost gone, or gone, uh, we'll send the troops over here, just raid over here, and just so occupy their territory. Uh, maybe, actually. Oh, what the hell was that? Yeah, this is. Uh, we gave some more territory away to uh, the others. Uh, we can now ask for a contribution, lowering them with 10. Uh, we don't need that right away. But look at that amount of money. That's just gorgeous. That really is nice. That truly really is nice. Um, I kind of want to get this one though going. Um, unfortunately, that's a few more years away. Uh, and just making the generous donation to get the admin. Yeah, I don't know. We'll need the admin, that is for sure. We are very much in favor. So, yeah, we need to focus also on our military ideas. Um, so... I want to be focusing on the, one of these two uh, before taking up tech. Uh, eventually, due to the uh, in a, in a constitutional penalty, it is so much more expensive. Look at that. That's over 600. So, we might just want to make sure we got some ideas done. Uh, we also have an alliance with France that will be very much short-lived. Also, uh, I doubt that... Austria is going to be okay with me taking these two provinces. But we're going to be trying anyways. And just see what happens. If it end ends up killing me. It ends up killing me. It's fine. Also, let's get this going. Get this guy back. Doesn't need to be there. So, we're going to wait here for a bit longer. And they're actually just losing troops. They're at negative 7. Are we going to deal with it? Actually, I kind of want to deal with it. Maybe it's uh, more important than uh, getting that uh, pocket money. Everyone go here. All the troops go back. We are still making... Well, the next tick we know for sure. 1.6 and we'll drop 1.14. Well, that's still fine. Let's group these guys up and let's go deal with these trips. We do need to support our ally once we're there. We'll go siege this all up. Yeah, there is no way you win, mate. You actually do get a negative one because this is defensive terrain for us. Can we go there? Are we? Can we not go there? Seriously? Let's see if we can actually get military access. Yeah, we can. That's uh, sucks for you, mate. So let's go. I wonder what you will do. So you're actually moving all the way up there. Which is extremely annoying. Shall we consolidate? I kind of don't feel like it. So. What kind of level is this? A level 3. So we need 9k to deal with that. And you are heading over to Breda. And then what? Okay, we'll just wait here. We'll take the fortress. 
We'll take the fortress and see. Hopefully, yes, there you go. He surrendered. We have a free diplomat. Let's sue for peace. We don't need this territory at all. All I want from you is um, war reps. All of your money. And let's do steer the trade. And all treaties. Yeah, I don't care about that. So let's set those demands. These guys are now out. He gets to go back to his own territory. And we all get some monies. Some well-earned money. Power projection is increasing. Prestige is going up. Too many diplomatic relations due to the military axis. Military axis with Tia. Uh, we, are a, we have an alliance. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yeah, okay, we have 6. So Burgundy will have to uh, drop eventually. Yeah, this won't take long. He is going to be declaring on me. That is, without a doubt. Let's just do the siege. And hopefully, you will go and deal with those troops. So what we can say is... Yeah, go there. What are you doing? Why are you sitting on his territory? You can't pass? Oh, there you go. Yeah, go deal with his troops. There he goes. He's going to be freeing this up. We'll have Tia deal with that. Come on, fight each other. Don't... Oh, look at this. Ah, this pure dumbasses. Absolutely brilliant. Go ahead. Why did you bypass each other? You have more troops. Military access from Galra. Let's accept that. Yes, thank you. Finally, they uh, they take it to the man. Uh, negative two, actually. Yeah, that's not good for you. Um, if we take this fort before he arrives... Yeah, we'll uh, just do the rest of it. Uh, we can actually do another repay in loans. 63. Let us repay. Oh, man, I'm so happy that we're actually getting out of these negatives. Ah oh, man, he lost all of his troops. He will be building up. Uh, but the air is already on its way. 1k is not going to be enough. So happy. I'm, I'm really I'm excited about this. Uh, but you can tell. I'm sure you can tell. We're making free now. Yeah, it's done. It's over. This war is over. Burgundy, are you getting troops on my border? Because that would make me very anxious. And I'm not going to be enjoying that. Our military leader has unfortunately left us. Can we get the nobility to grant... Oof. Oh, that's too much influence for you. Oh, that's too much. I don't want to do this. I would have to take away territory from them. Well, we don't need a military leader right away. And we would gain like... A what? A 3 to 9 pip. General. It's still okay, I guess. Uh, but I kind of want to do it in a different manner. And we cannot get him in without me on my own territory. Uh, peace offer from Munster. Let's uh, neglect that. We'll, we are going to be the boss of our peace deals. Influencing nations on Archon. Oh, that's just great. That's just great. Yeah, he is a great power now. He's going to be influencing. He's going to build everyone against me. And I don't like this. He's drilling troops next to my border. I really don't like that. And the unrest in Groningen is annoying. That's a 15 stack, right? So we'll have more than em enough. So there we go. That's, uh, that's the end of the war. So, Leech or Leech, whatever. Oh, you're, you're rich. I like that. War reps. And 
Do the transfer and trades. Set demands. So we get more money. Let's pay off this uh, this loan. Get all of our troops back. And let's piece this out. What are we able to do with you? Sue for peace. And... Uh... Okay, so far no coalition. And I do want to get both of these. I want all of your money. And for the rest you can't give me anything. Let's set demands. They're now mine. What is going to happen? And this is something that I'm very scared of. Aggressive expansion. Let us break the military axis. And start building up again with my allies. Um, making sure that we... Uh, Improve relations with Austria first. Get that above 100. Let us get another infantry. How many troops can we actually get now? 18. And we're making very nice money. But uh, this is uh, <laughs> due to uh, spoils of war. 2.45. I'm saying we should get those cannons in now. Three cannons. So that would be, I think it should be enough. Three cannons and an infantry. As long as we can deal with, um, with some of these uh, states. Now, due to the Protestants, uh, they should be liking me. And they're still part of the HRE. We did grow. We now got uh, the entire state under control. Let's call these two up. Yeah, we did it. That was a sweet short war. Loose lips. Let's send you over here because we know that it's going to happen. This is going to happen. Uh, Groningen. So, we're going to keep maintenance up. One troop is going to be built. Ah, there we go. Uh-oh. Uh, that's not good. We are currently having no pluses. Can we change this? Uh, we can actually increase the trust. Uh, can we make sure that this is not happening? We need to change this. Alliance breaking is going to be imminent. The trust is negative too. Let us spend... 10 favors for that. And now we are plus 6. So the alliance is not going to be bro uh, broken. So, and I want to keep Austria as an ally. Uh, and there is definitely, there's the core ring going. Rebel uprising, 16k troops in uh, Groningen. So that is not good. What is their military tech? Quite high. We do want to make sure we, uh, we are ready for that this costs me 30 though uh, i wouldn't go to four cannons so that's three trips that's 16 so we could actually get two more infantry i think that's the best uh oh no Okay, so Thier is at war with Gelra. Lorraine and Oldenburg. Actually, this would work in my favor. He asked Oldenburg and Lorraine to join. If we do this, we can get this guy out right away. Focus on Gelra. I think we are going to be honoring the call. Honoring the call would be the best decision. Also, we are almost at 100%. We'll just let this build up, whatever. So, let us accept this war. There's one more thing that we need to do. And that is get ourselves a general. And we got a 2, 3, incredibly nothing. Let's go and make sure this happens. So, Galra is now my ally. 
Cleaves is annoying. Yeah, you got a claim on that. Yeah, but yeah, you are currently heading straight into a war with me. I'm not sure if you realize this, but it's bad for you. It is. So let's get those troops out. And you're going to be dealing with that. Let's make sure we get these two together again. And let's take care of those uh, Cleveland troops. There we go. And now Galra will join in. Even though we get a negative two, it's due to troops that we're doing fine. Now, let's take a look. Did he just get a skill up? No, he didn't. Yeah, cavalry flanking ability plus 50. Where are you heading towards? Cleveland troops. Yeah, we're going to be following you and just kicking you out. If possible. So, you go here. Who else are we currently at war with? Lorraine. Let's not care about them right away. Now, we can't take more territory because we don't need to lose Austria. Let's consolidate. That's back to 9. 10, 11. We don't have to build up as much. Let's get 11 troops back. Siege this down. Let's take a look. Uh, relationships. Oldenbrook is siege down and this is going to be something. That's 10k troops still. 11k shortly. One versus one. It's a cavalry versus an infantry. I think, yeah. The cavalry won. Of course. Of course they did. But what can we do with... Um, try Stop trying. So let's recall the diplomat from Austria. And let's put you back on allies. So here we go. We're completely full again. There is 10k heading our way. Uh, we only need 3 to do this. And we are going to be backing him up once he's locked. Once you're locked, you're going to be losing everything. There you go, you're locked. So... Let us do one and do like this. Select these troops, the other one, and you're going over here. Because you are going to head over to Bergen and we are going to help you. Or just make sure we get these troops out. Yeah, I think this is a good call. This is a good call. Lorraine, where are you again? You're over here. Let's go to your fortress. And let's make sure you will not forget me. Can we do a fight with you? Yeah, we can. There you go. Low morale versus me. I think we are getting a negative though. Uh, but we won. And we'll follow you all the way. And that means that we have everything occupied. This war is over. And France, you are fighting Castile. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, Castile, you are so scary. You are so scary. Seriously scary. I don't, I don't like it at all. Uh, do we have still the edict going? No, we don't. The unrest is uh, quite a bit, though. Yeah, everything is now being sieged down. Quite nice. I like it. I like it so far. We're making good money now. It's come under the occupation of uh, Cologne. That's us, of course. Is any of you... Wow, you got a lot of money there. Is this ticking? Level 3 fortress. No, it is not. But you're at, at least preventing them from building troops. And I'm okay with that. Yeah, I will have to stab you in the back, mate. I will. Can I make you my vessel? 
Gain prestige or devotion. Let's gain prestige. Yeah. Thierry is an electorate. As long as he is my vassal, things are okay. And as long as I have claims on him, it is okay. What kind of allies? Yeah, Galra would come to your aid. And the Pomerade. And that's kind of annoying to deal with. Wait, are my ships... Oh, they're safe. Wow, they just have four. <laughs> wow. I completely forgot about that. Let's build up two more ships. I want to make sure that my navy gets in there. And you are not... Yeah, you are sieging it down. Let's just raid for a while. And this is all going to fall. Berg. It's completely empty now. We have a military alliance. Or actually a, a military access from Vandenberg. Let's accept that. Who are you currently at war with? Bermithia. Sure, why not? We're making four, guy. Look at this. We're making bloody four. That's insane. And there we go. Uh, we have our own uh, problems to deal with now. And we are going to be dealing with it. Uh, before they get too strong. I think yeah the war is done. And they took Berg. That means that I would like to get Cleaves. Uh, but the air is a problem. Ah. <sighs> We have a lot of favors with you. And I'm not a great power. Who, who are great powers, actually? Castile number one. Yeah, and he's my ally. Austria is not a great power. Really? And the Ottomans have been insane. Lithuania, are you expanding? I think you just lost Ki uh, Kiev. Interesting. Not sure about this. Uh, we'll just have to see. How are you doing? Are you still friends with them? Muscovy. You're, so you're fighting alone. Against Muscovy. And you are semi doing well. Okay, that's cool. So, let's get these guys up. We'll have to deal with those troops. And let's get them together. And then deal with this. It's going to take some time. Uh, before this uh, triggers. Too few rivals. Let's see, who are my options? Burgundy. Uh, Gelra. And Saxony. I quite like to go with Saxony first. So let's go Saxony. And that also means that we just broken our alliance with Saxony. As for the other one. Let us go with... Not, not this one. I don't want uh, to lose another... Pomerania already hates me. So, let's just do those. There we go, two more. We're over our power projection, so we're making good points again. In terms of technology, I think it's time that we go and take that tick. And we'll wait with this one for a bit, though. Uh, we're getting close to fort defense. Even right now, my fortress are maintained. And... I'm thinking about getting a fort in Meppen. We actually have a church, workshop and barracks. Hmm. A fortress in here would provide stability for this entire region. 
Osnabrück would probably be more ideal. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 for in the future. So getting a fortress in here would be quite nice. We're making 7 free too? Whoa! <laughs> a few episodes and get go. I was like, oh my god, how am I going to fix my economy? Spoils of war is, is, is immensely helping, of course, but oh, still. Oh, man. Okay, so. This is a bit much, I think, to deal with my trips. He don't have a general. Can we deal with it? 14 regiments. How long until this becomes a problem? So he's not even done yet. Lowered taxes. Low is that your thing? Is is that what you're doing this? Lower taxes? Let's stop it for a bit. If I were to accept demand, we will gain autonomy in Let's see. Paddenborn? Osnabrück. Where the hell is Paddenborn? Paderborn. But it's over here. So, Paddenborn, Osnabrück, Hoya, and Groningen. And that will generate less autonomy or less unrest. It would just cost me a tiny bit of money for the time this goes. I kind of think we don't need to do this. I kind of think that we can actually win this. Okay, let's just give it a try. If I fail, I fail. And it's on me. It is on me if I fail this. We have our troops. We have a general. And yeah. I'm glad that I did not accept that. Because their morale is gone. We win. That's it. We won. <laughs> Quite nice. So, yeah, we're still building ships and making 048 at the moment due to reinforcements. We are without debt. We, have, we don't have any loans. And I think we're going to be making sure that we have to deal with Saxony. Austria, we need to wait until we get the aggressive expansion allied to rival with France. I kind of feel that I want to break my alliance with France then. Dissolve alliance. That's probably what I need to do. But that would probably cost me a lot of prestige. And I kind of am happy that we are getting prestige again. So we can just hold on. Austria is not a immediate threat. So we don't need to deal with that. Let us train. Uh, once we don't need to reinforce, we'll actually make money. I kind of want to do that in this episode. So next episode, we can actually deal with what else is going to be um, springing into actions, like Mappen and Munster, who are throwing out 15k. And I'm actually okay with that. Let's let it. It's fine. Uh, with four out of five relations, France, Austria, Thier, and Castile, because we broke with Saxony. Uh, it's your opinion on me. You actually think I'm, I suck. Which is fine. And we'll take Saxony. Saxony could be our vessel. That would be a nice vessel. That's a big chunk. In being our vessel. Yeah, I think that might be... Uh oh. Austria. Negative two reasons. <sighs> okay, how can we deal with this? So, it actually is a problem that I'm with France. Okay. Let's get you back. And let's break my alliance with France. Here we go. Austria is pleased again. Burgundy, can we do something with you? Why do you hate me so badly? Now, you're big enough for me not to worry about you becoming my rival... Uh, but I kind of think 
Let's do outrage countries. We do have uh, those. And we are just drilling our armies right here. Making 2.8. I'm happy about it. I am. And let's uh, get some more ships. We can still build a few. Why not? We'll build a few. Anything else that we got? Well, we're getting close. We're getting close to actually complete some of these missions. I'm happy, guys. I am extremely happy about this. Uh, we've dealt with Austria not wanting to be my ally. And we have Castile. Castile is uh, amazing. Heretic. Yeah, that's a bit of a thing, though. We are Protestant. So, yeah. Not sure how to deal with all of this. Join the Reformation. Convert provinces. I don't think I can do that. No, we can't. Which is unfortunate. Uh, we should invest in this. Look at that. That's just an increase of a flat 20. Which is quite nice. But then again, we don't have that kind of money. So, a man can dream. Let's just call it that. A man can dream. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I did. I know that for a fact. And I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.